From this version of Peter Pan, they can expect some fantastic acting across the board. Gorgeous singing, dancing, also some really exciting puppetry. It's a really beautiful journey, written gorgeously. We've been working with Vicky Stone, who is an incredible lyricist and composer, and she's written brand new songs. And they're very upbeat, very funky. The choreography is mad, it's isn't it? Sharp. It's sharp. I, yeah. I watch a lot of it, and it is brilliant. Bradley, the choreographer, has got everyone drilled brilliantly. I need these steps, I need these counts, but also I need a pirate with a limp and one arm. It's original to the rose, like it's been written and adapted. All of it's fresh, it's new music, it's new choreography, like it's something that no one has seen before. It's not often that you get to write something for a cast of like 24. You're seeing a great show, but you're also seeing a lot of young people giving it their all and having the time of their lives. And there are not a lot of theatres that I know of that involve the community in such a great way. And boy, did they make the most of it. What's lovely about having two casts is that you get to watch your counterpart make all these beautiful choices, and then you can steal it and, and be like, okay, I'm gonna like, do that as well. I think what was exciting about writing for a big cast is creating the world of Peter Pan, especially at Christmas time of coming to see a really massive show that's gonna take you to sort of a faraway yeah. place. Everything about it, the dances, the writing, the directing, the music, like everything is just so from the heart. That's a beautiful story, isn't it, for Christmas? We've woven Christmas into the story, which is yeah. not in the original. So it's all set at Christmas. What does that mean for the darling children? What does that then mean for the lost boys who've never had Christmas before? The Christmas. Everything okay. goes on pause. Is it Tuesday? Is it Thursday? No one knows. And the same thing happens in Neverland. What day is it? We don't have time, so it doesn't matter. When you talk to people about Peter Pan, well, he's a boy who never grows up. And there's something about Christmas that brings out the child in all of us. Yeah. And it's the one time of year none of us need to sort of grow up. No matter where everyone is, either in the country or in the world, people always come back together as family for Christmas. Yeah. It's such a mixture of magic and hope and love. So the meaning of Christmas comes out in this story to make it a really gorgeous, magical production.